Hello and welcome to the wet mount slide video tutorial. This video will go through the basics of making a wet mount slide using the prokaryotic alga Anabina. All of the materials we use here will be available in your lab room. Your TA will indicate their location during your lab, which is typically next to one of the sinks. First, obtain a clean microscope slide. Place the slide on a flat surface. Use the plastic pipette to obtain anabena. You will only need a few drops, so don't fill the pipette. You may have to shake the tube of anabena if you notice that they have settled to the bottom of the tube. Place one or two drops of anabena near the center of the slide. Pick up a cover slip by the edges. Handle these carefully, they are made of thin glass and break easily. While holding the cover slip at 45 degrees, touch the bottom edge to the slide at the edge of the drop of anabina. Slowly lower the outer edge of the cover slip onto the sample. If you need to, use a dissection needle to lower the cover slip edge. If you have lowered the cover slip properly, there should be no visible air bubbles in your prep. If there are many large air bubbles, you will need to try again. If there is too much water and the cover slip is floating, touch the edge of a paper towel to the edge of the cover slip. This will absorb excess water. When you look at this slide on your compound microscope, remember the basic steps. Start on low power. Find something to focus on, even if it is just the edge of the cover slip. And close down the iris diaphragm. Once finished with your slide, rotate to the 4 power objective and pick up your slide. The cover slip can be tossed into the sharps disposal bin at the sink. Don't try to clean them or they will break. The slide itself should be rinsed, washed with soap, rinsed again and dried with a paper towel before being returned to the slide box. This is the basic procedure to making a wet mount slide and a look at our bacterial friend Anabena. In the following videos, we will discuss the procedure for other preparations that all follow the basic wet mount procedure.